is my favorite day. He made it a special day. I love tomorrow. Yesterday, but today is my favorite day. Is today your favorite day? Mine is very, very much better. How are you? I hope you're well. It's your teacher, Anansieta. Welcome to Easy Elimo. Learning Simplified. Who can remind me what we did in grade 2? When you were making the multiplication table, we did the multiplication of 1, we did the 1 for 2, we did for 3, we did for 4, and we did for 5. Last week we did for 6, 7, and today we want to do the multiplication table for number 8 and 9. Now, what did we say the rule for multiplication is? Rule number 1, any number times a 0 is a 0. So that's why I did not include here. Should I write your zeros throughout? No. Any number times a 1 is that number, and that is it. Any number times this 1 is just that number. But now when we come to 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, they keep on changing depending on 2 or 3 things. Now, multiplication table for number 2, we just say it is the addition of counting in 2s. So the answer you get, you multiply by 2, you get the answer. You add to 2, you get the answer. For example, 1 times 2, 1 times 2 gives me what? 2. This 2, for me to get the next answer, this is 2 times 2. I'll say 2 times 2. What do I get? 2 times 2 is this answer plus a 2. Because I'm counting in 2. So I'll have 2, 3, 4. I get here a 4. Then I have this 3 times 2. 3 times 2. What do I get? This answer plus 2. I get 4, 5, 6. I get a 6. Then we continue this number 4 times a 2. And what do we get? 6 in the head, 7, 8. So we are simply adding a 2 to the number. Adding 2 to the number. Then I have 5 times 2. What do I get? 5 times 2, 8, 9, 10. You see? Same to 3. If I'm given 3, I have 1 times 3. What do I get? I get the 3. Any number times a 1 is that number. Then we're talking about 2 times 3. 2 times 3. I'm saying it is 3 plus 3. 3 plus 3. Get 4, 5, 6. I get a 6. Then I have 3 times 3. How will I get 3 times 3? 3 times 3 is 6 plus 3. So I'll say 6, 7, 8, 9. I'll get a 9. Then next I have 4 times 3. How do I get 4 times 3? It is this 9 plus the 3. So I'll say 9, 10, 11, 12. Then I have 5 times 3. What do I get? 5 times 3, it is this 12, the answer I got in the previous question, plus the 3. So you say 12, 13, 14, 15. And it is as simple as that. So you will be continuing the rest. Now when it comes to the multiples of 4, I have 1 times 4, any number times are 1 is that number. Then I come to 2 times 4. What is 2 times 4? It is this 4 plus 4. So I'll say 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Then I come here. The next number is 3 times 4. How do I get 3 times 4? I put 8 in the head plus this 4. That is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Then I come 4 times 4. How do I get 4 times 4? I'll take the 12, the answer that I got in the previous question, plus because we are counting in fours. So we are saying 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Then I come here, I have a 5 times 4. How do I get? I have 16 plus 4. So 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So you're going to finish 
the remaining multiplication table of number 5. How? This is the easiest. This is the easiest. Any number times a 5 is? Any number times a 1 is that number. So you come to 2 times 5. What do I say? It is 5 plus 5. What is 5 plus 5? 10. Then I come 3 times 5. What is it? 10 plus 5. This is 5, 10, 15. We are counting in 5s. Then we have 4 times 5. What do I say? 5, 15 plus 5, it is 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then we have a 5 times 5. How do I get it? It is 20 plus 5, which is 25. Alternatively, you can use your finger. Any number when you're counting, just count 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. What does it mean? 5 is 1 times 5. 10 is 5, 5 times 2, 15 is 5 times 3, 20 is 5 times 4, and 25 is 5 times 5. So each finger represents 5. Each finger represents 5. So this one is 5. When I add plus 5, I get a 10, 15, 20, and 25. Multiplication table for number 6. How do we do it? We come here. Any number times a 1 is that number. Then we come 2 times 6. What is 2 times 6? We are counting in 6, so it will be 6 plus 6. 6 plus 6 is 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Then we come 3 times 6. What does it give you? It gives you 3 times 6, it is a 12 plus B6. So you say 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Then we come to 4 times 6. Let's see. We have 18 in our head, 6 fingers out. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Then we have 5 times 6. And what is 5 times 6? If we use our method, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So 6 times 5 is 30. Have you seen the way it's easy? So we move on to the multiplication table of number 7. So we have here 7 times 1. What do you get? 1 times 7, what do you get? We get 7. Any number times a 1 is that number. Now, what is 2 times 7? 2 times 7 is 2, 7 plus 7. So what is 7 plus 7? Someone has already said 14. That is nice. What about 3 times 7? 3 times 7 is 7 plus 7 plus 7. So it means it is 14 plus this 7. And what do you get? 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Then we have 4 times 7, it will be 21 plus 7, and you get 28. Then we have 5 times 7, it will be this 28 plus 7, where you get 35. So have you seen that? Wow, we're moving on well. Now we are on the multiplication table of number 8. We are saying any number times a 1 is that number. So what is 2 times 8? 2 times 8 is like 8 plus 8. What is 8 plus 8? Janet? 16. Very good. Then we have 3 by 8. And what is 3 by 8? It is 16 plus 8. And then you say 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. And then we have 4 times 8, what is 4 times 7? 8, you say 24 in the head, 8 fingers out. So it is 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. And then we have 5 times 8. Let's use our method. We said every finger represents 5. So we say 
5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, and 40. So you get your answer as 40. Now, for number 9, it is very easy. Because I know most of you will get tired of counting 9 sticks every now and then. Just say, any number times a 9, a 1 is that number. So let's see, this is 2 times 9, 3 times 9, 4 times 9, 5 times 9, 6 times 9, 7 times 9, 8 times 9. Now we have squeezed these things. So that's 4 times 9, then this is 3 times 9, we have 6 times 9, we have 7 times 9, 8 times 9, 9 times 9, and 10 times 9. Let's see what happens on 9. This one is very, very easy. Now, what happens here is you just count. Count numbers, you've said nine. So what normally comes here is nine, then reduce eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Are we together? Then after that, when you go now count going up, this one will be going up and that one going down. So here we have 9 again, reduce 8, 7, 6, 5, not 3, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, and zero. You see the way I got my answers? You write the numbers interlocking in a way that from here you write nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero, going down as you reduce. Then from down again you start nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Now someone tell me something. What have you realized on this multiplication table? Somebody tell me something on this multiplication table. What have you realized? Can I tell you something? All the numbers in there, counting in ones, they are just following each other. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All the answers that are counting in twos, they are increasing by two. Four, six, this two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. So, which means the next number will be 20. Then, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, and 27. Then, counting in fours, we say 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36. And counting in fives, we say 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. So you can tell me which one is the next number. So I want you to finish multiplication table for number 6. So for 2, 3, 4 multiplied by the 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Just the way we have done it there. Any question up to there? Any problem? It was nice having you around and I hope I'll see you in the next lesson as we complete our multiplication table of number 10. Thank you.